let's start. A 12-year-old girl with a one-year history of systemic lupus erythematosus is brought to the physician for a routine follow-up examination. During the past year, she has done well, with the exception of occasional mild frontal headaches, fatigue, and arthralgias. The results of regular laboratory evaluations have been stable. She has missed 20 days of school in the past four months. Her parents expressed concern that sending her to school might cause her to be exposed to children with contagious diseases that might exacerbate their daughter's condition. The girl tells the physician that she misses seeing her many friends at school. Passive motion of the elbows, wrists, and knees produces mild discomfort. Physical examination shows no other abnormalities. Which of the following is the most likely cause of this patient's excessive school absences? So, the correct answer here is E. Sometimes, parents can be overly protective of their children with chronic diseases. This child doesn't have said, so going to school isn't going to kill her. The child is in overall reasonable health with only mild symptoms. Vulnerable child syndrome is characterized by unreasonable parental anxiety 